Hey guys, welcome to the video. Um, I thought I'd do a video on a kind of an unboxing on War Games Atlantic, the Great War, um, World War One, Germans. Um, <clears throat> so this is kind of a new box set out recently. Um, I picked it up because I've really wanted to do World War One quite a while, and this just seems such a such a great box set, and uh, you can do a lot with it. So um, yeah, I thought I'd kind of do an unboxing. So I won't show too much of the box. But it's some really nice poses from what you can see what you can do with the minis which is really cool um so yeah um i've already had this all apart so i won't literally do an unboxing but i'll show you what's inside it so um straight away we got this sprue here of um six people and there's five sprues of this in the box they're all the same sprues so um i won't go through all the others um but yeah, so you've got five different types of bodies, one kneeling down, some nice different poses. Um, and then just a few options for, well, there's a lot on here actually. Um, <clears throat> loads of head options. You've got the pickle halb, I can never pronounce it. Um, you've got the stalhelm, I can't remember what that's exactly called. Um, you've got the same stalhelm, but with a gas mask. And then you've got the plain like field cap. Um, and then you've got all the add extra bits, like you've got uh, your row of um, stick grenades and row of shovels and packs. Um, plus these here, I, I I don't know what these are actually. I think they're going to be gas mask related, maybe. Um, funny enough, it doesn't actually come with an instruction booklet in the box. Whether that was just my box, I don't know. Um, so when it comes to putting these together, there's no kind of description of what stuff is. So there's this thing here. No idea what that is. Um, so yeah. But yeah, you've got like a load of rifle options. You've got some pistol arm options. You've got um, kind of this little submachine gun. Um, is it the MP18? I don't know. It says it's somewhere. Yeah, MP18. I think that's what that is. And then you've got a, a Maxim machine gun as well. So you've got the options of doing some rifle teams, um, a heavy machine gun team, an officer, quite comfortably. So yeah, it's nice. And the one thing, I have put some of these together. The one thing I noticed is it's surprising how restricted you are on arms and weapons when they decide to give you um, six different head, like uh, four types of head um, for these miniatures. Yet yeah, when it comes to the actual rifles and stuff, you find yourself using every single rifle option pretty much um so there's kind of that similar pose going to it and also if you want there's a, a few options of rifles being held in one hand but then your other arm option there isn't much going on there either so um for instance you can't have someone holding a rifle on his shoulder and then just having his arm down by his side it's always got to have a grenade in it or something like that so or or holding a pack or something so i'm sure with some modifications you can do that um so it's not impossible, especially with like the grenade arms. You could just cut the grenade out and have them with a fist. So, um, but yeah, some really nice options. I'll quickly skim through this and then kind of show you the rest. But yeah, when it comes to building a few of them, there are it is labelled on the sprue kind of what rifles what. If you look there, you got A one, and then that links up to A 2s arm. So it's kind of yeah, you don't really need instruction book, but it does help just kind of explain what some of the bits are so yeah that's the um that's the sprue nothing special well i say nothing special very it is special but um yeah nothing else i need to to show you it's pretty pretty standard bodies arms heads and guns right i'll um show you now what i've built up i'm going to build up this sprue as well and just show you the whole box set and what i'm going to be doing with it <clears throat> right so i've built up that last sprue um so this is kind of what i've built out the whole box set <clears throat> So I'll start over here. I've got my um, like I've made a six-man trench raider team. So these are with the um, is it Stalhelm, Stalhelm uh, helmets out with gas masks. Um, they're kind of yeah all posed to be a bit more of an assaulting team. Um, so loaded up with grenades. Apart from this one, isn't but yeah, loaded up with grenades and uh, got the MP18 in there as well, which looks nice. Um. And then I've got a rifleman squad back here of nine. And these have all got just the pickle halb um, helmets. 
Um, yeah, they're all rifles. Um, I've given, I've tried to tried to make a bit more of a an officer in the group. So I've got him, kind of waving on the advance, and then in the set I've built here. These five here are going to finish off a four, uh, the rifle team back here with this four to make a nine man team. Um, just looking at the officer there that I've uh, got him pointing and shouting, so he's telling people where to go, sort of thing. <clears throat> so yeah, that's my. Um, the two rifle teams, trench raiding team, and then I've got an officer with two riflemen. So he's got like a field cap, officer's cap, and he's pointing. Um, kind of another loaded up chap with a pipe in his mouth. Um, he's sitting with his officer, being important. Um, and then I've done a tiny, tiny bit of conversion work with this set because I really like the pickle hel helmets, but I want the gas masks as well. Um, so it looks rough here, but I'm going to go a bit more in depth and fill it in but um, this is my Maxim team uh, and they've all got these pickle halben face masks so this guy here is holding a holding a ammo pack and then the gunner I've just made out of this box set I found a use for that arm I was pointing out but I didn't know what it was it was actually for this um, for the gun so yeah I've got to do a bit of green stuff on the back because the arms didn't quite match up for some reason. I don't know why. Even though I followed the box set pose, but who's, who knows. Um, so yeah, that's kind of what I've done with this box set. You can kind of see that there's lots of variation. And um, I think two riflemen team, like large riflemen teams, an officer, a heavy machine gun and some kind of assault teams, probably enough for a small skirmish game. Um, I've actually got the, the rule set now for... Um, through the mud and blood from two fat lardies, possibly looking at blood and plunder, uh, blood and valor as well. Um, but I'll see. So yeah, um, hope you kind of enjoy the video, and I hope it's been useful to anyone who's looking to buy in this box set. Um, you can pl do plenty with it. There's some nice options, um, and you can always modify bits of bits and bobs, arms and stuff like that, just to kind of change it up a bit as well. So. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoy the video and as always keep an eye out for any videos I do in the future. Cheers guys.